Welcome to World Cinema Reviews. This is your host, Frank the Vamp. And, uh, you know, I'm so glad uh, to be back here in 2016. Hopefully, there are way many more reviews. Apologize for the lack of activity, you know, back in the month of December. But like I said, you know, the combination of work, the holidays, and, and everything else just made it really hard. But I'm back here with you. Apologize to my subscribers and, and new viewers as well. You know, get ready for a lot more content. On to the review today. Tonight, I mean, we have Krampus. And um, going in and having mixed things, um, you know, because usually when you go on Christmas, you know, when you have Christmas horror, it can either be very good or it can be really bad. I mean, I've I seen over the years many, you know, many examples of both. So I was like going with an open mind, you know, uh, going in there, haven't heard any reviews or anything like that. But after I watched Krampus, let me just say that I was really, really, really loving it. And and I mean, I love it so much that this may even become what what I think will become a new holiday classic when it comes to Christmas horror. Um, it basically covers, you know, this legend that you know throughout the world, you know, you have this. You know legends that if you're not good if you haven't been a good kid around Christmas time not only you won't get any toys but you know you may actually get taken um, you know in some some cultures you know you have them the, the, the boogeyman kind of take you on a bag or something like that and, and take you away from your parents and you won't see them anymore ever you know but you know, in, in it's that's sort of like what this German legend is about. You know, Krampus, and um, basically the movie. It, it's sort of a dark fairy tale where it takes you that. You know, it it gives you a real look what Christmas looks like now. It starts kind of showing you the shop inside of Christmas, and, and and what it has become, and that it has lost all meaning. Like it's no longer about the love between one another, the giving, the selfless acts of kindness. It's all about commercialism. It's all about kids wanting this, wanting that, but not caring about the less fortunate ones. So it kind of, I'm not going to tell you exactly what happens, but it involves one family where kind of the meaning of Christmas is lost. And, and something is done that it brings out this demon you know fiend from the death of hell you know that kind of like it's like at the anti Santa Claus you know? and, and, and the movie is just so awesome because it works it works it's hilarious as a comedy um, you know there's this um, there's Conchetta Farrell you know playing this 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 anti the one that nobody likes and she's great I, I like the kid the, who plays Max and his name is Kate right now um, you know, I, I I like the family. Um, you know, the, the 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 family. You know, just being very. You know, not 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 very cohesive. Not you know, not not your typical awesome family on Christmas time. You know, Adam Scott plays uh, plays Tom Engel, and the father who's kind of more worried about making money than than, than just being with the children, and and. You know, I, I, and you know, without any spoilers, at the end, you really, you really see you know, how things can affect you, and, and how you can turn it around and still have an awesome Christmas. And 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 it's just beautiful, just beautiful, just love it. You know, it, it's it's the right level. It's not that gory. Um, you know, some of the stuff, some of the images can be scary. You know. Um, maybe not even Krampus himself I think maybe some of the and I think I heard, I heard this before from other people too that some of the the, the helpers some of the elves you know the, the, that help Krampus you know they're demonic little things and toys too that come out of this bag instead of nice toys they're demonic toys and everything works beautifully here so if you like Christmas horror if you like legends and dark fairy tales, Krampus is the one for you. I definitely recommend it. I give it a B plus. Must definitely must watch. Uh, I think it was, should become one of my favorites to watch every Christmas too. 
So if you like Christmas horror, there's your dish. Happy New Year, everybody. Be safe. Be blessed. We'll see you next review. Take care. And be good. So the West Krampus will make a visit for you next year.